All right, y'all. Back at it again. 19th pick. Cleveland is back on the board. Again, as I stated, with their first pick, they need a receiver and a nose tackle with the first one, considering that there aren't too many um, D tackles worthy of a first round pick. Uh, they took Malcolm Brown out of Texas. Um, considering there's not many more receivers that's left that's worth that, this pick right here, I'm going to give him Darrell Green Beckham. Wide receiver out of um, Missouri. Um, the real green Beckham is a sizable receiver, 6'5", 237, run 4'5", 4'6", great leaping ability, big hands, big physical guy. Um, I think he could fit the bill nicely for them while Josh Gordon is away dealing with his issues. So... Um, I don't really need to say much with this. I think he fits a need for them right now. And um, whether he can come in and contribute day one, that's remained to be seen. But I do believe he's a talent that they can't afford to pass up on. Over the years, I've watched the draft time and time and time again. And I've watched Cleveland pass up on great talents um, each year. I could go back as far as, okay, now you guys know I'm a Steelers fan, and I'm so happy that they did pass up on this because I don't know if we would have six rings right now. Um, going back, they passed up on Ben Roethlisberger and took Kellen Winslow Jr., and it don't take a rocket scientist to see how that's turned out. Here you have a hometown guy a guy from your area, and you pass up on him. Um, to me, you can't afford to make that kind of decision when you have a tradition of losing, 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 losing over the past mm, 20, 30 years maybe. And they made that decision. Um, uh Man, it's it's just been a plethora of decisions that they have made in terms of the draft. Guys they brought in and passed up on that I question. So with this one, in my opinion, I think they should go with DGB, wide receiver out of Missouri.